hello guys today uh, we are going to learn how to create a new team group with office 365 admin center the first thing what you have to do you have to log in with uh, admin.microsoft.com and then admin portal once you will go to admin portal then you can go to this tab where we call it team and groups under the team and groups you can click on active team and groups and then you will see if you have any team or groups by default you can see this one group is created called all company apart from that we don't have any groups here so first what do you need to do we have to go and create one group so first thing you have to go and click on this here you can see multiple categories we have to select only uh, Microsoft 365 click here it will ask you by default because we already selected the category that's the reason it's by default pick Microsoft 365 recommended because this group has the capability to collaborate all the uh, application that we required in Microsoft team so let's give a name description and then you just go down click next it will ask you to assign an honor so we are going to add one honor here Here we go and add why we need a owner because owner is a person who is going to manage uh, Microsoft team he has the complete control over the team uh, he or she who can basically add the members can remove the members can create the channels can modify the channels can delete the channels so that's the reason we need owner then we need the members and here we can go and choose multiple person as an honor of that particular team click add click next then we, we need an email address of that particular group so this is the name so we are going to use same as an email address and then we have the option here what kind of team group you want to create you want to create a public type of team or group or you want to create a private type of thing so let's suppose I don't want uh, anyone to see this group or only it limited to the IT department only and then you can see this option we have two option here first options I'm going to add this this particular group to Microsoft team right that means uh, once I, I'll select this option it automatically make it uh, enable in in team if I don't choose this option here then I have to go to team uh, portal and from there I have to add it but for now I just want to check this box because I want to enable team click next and then uh, this is the description so we have o365 type of group here and the basic description of the the group the owner of the group the members of the groups email address of that particular group group type right whether you want to enable that group with Microsoft team yes or no and if everything as per your requirement just click on this particular part once you do that this group will be created as a team group and you will able to see this group in Microsoft team admin center so now but we can close it here we have to go back and just we need to see and we can see one more group is there right 
and here you can see uh, it's a cloud group so not synced from anywhere right and uh, the type of this group is a private one now we have to go to team center and just do a bit refresh here so whatever the team group we have created in O365 admin portal we'll able to see it here then you can click on teams manage team and you just go to bed down and you can see there is one team created and these are the member of that team and once a user will log in in the machine he or she will able to see that particular so if I'm logging here I want to see this team I'm able to see it Now you can see that I'm logging and registering this device with my Microsoft team and we're good. So let's see if we'll able to see this team. So here you can see uh, this this team is created and by default there is a there is a standard channel that's you can see with each of the the team right so we with the same name we call it journal right and under that you can see the post right you can download team with this you can see the file if you have any wiki or anything then you can see that and you can uh, also able to create a, a team from here or join existing team and if you go here on this three dots you have the, have the options to add a new channel to this particular team so i'm the owner so i'm going to add um, and I'm creating a standard channel if you want to make it private then only the teammates can access it this is a private so I want to make it private so let's go and add it and then you can see who can access from your team so I don't want this to access by all members 
so I only want one person to access it so now I've created a, and then you can see this particular uh, symbol on it that means this is a private channel and can only access by the member that I have assigned to it thank you for watching